What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Tell me baby why don't you love me when I make me so damn busy love, love, love. Layla, I'm serenading. I just wanted to make a video about jealousy and how to get over it. Because you can get over it, but it starts with how you feel about yourself. But before I get into it, go ahead and subscribe, and subscribe, and subscribe. There are multiple ways that you can be jealous of other people. One way is they have more money than you. It's like they always have the new designer clothes, the new designer shoes, the best freaking designer makeup. The most expensive dog braids, their weaves. It's like they got a new wig every month. When people have more money than us, they're able to do things that we feel like we can't afford, like travel or go out to the clubs more or go to more shows, go to more concerts, be able to afford to go to Coachella. Shoot. Shoot. I'll let you in on a little secret though. You don't need that much money to be able to do those things. But that's for another video. I'll save that for another time. You can also be jealous of someone's living circumstances. Maybe they have their own apartment and you're still living at your parents' house. Like me. But hey, I'm milking it. When you're jealous of somebody's physical appearance. Oh Lord, this is the biggest thing. Like it's, with Instagram models, it is so easy to be insecure about how we look. All these Instagram models with the abs and the boobs and no cellulite. It makes you feel like you're not good enough. One thing that I'm sure everybody can say they've been jealous of at least once in their lifetime is the amount of attention that they see somebody else getting. Whether it's from the opposite sex or maybe this person is funny and outgoing and so people naturally gravitate towards them and you're just kind of there and you're just like, wow, I mean, I, what am I, chopped liver? Hi! This is one thing that I was jealous of. Watching other people get all of this attention and feeling as though they didn't deserve it because I know they're not a good person deep down. And that's really not my place to say, but a lot of the people on Instagram that are portraying to be humble or giving or kind or genuine don't even really know the true meaning of those words. Like I said, it's really not my place to say that, but I can see through a lot of it. Like I can see through a lot of the stuff that people post on social media, the, the people that they portray to be on social media. I can see through a lot of that. I can see through the shallowness. I can see through the selfishness. I feel like I totally got off subject there, but I just had to touch on that. Anyway, so you can be jealous of the amount of attention that people are getting, especially when you know it's all fake. Okay, moving on. When you're jealous of relationships, someone's relationship, it could be you're jealous of someone's romantic relationship or you're jealous of someone's friendship. It's like you want that person's attention, you want that person's time, and you aren't the one getting it, so it makes you mad, it makes you jealous, it makes you hate the person that they're spending more time with, even if you don't really know. And when you're jealous of someone's success, ooh, that's a dangerous one. When you're jealous of how successful people are, it's usually because you're comparing where you are to where they are. Maybe you're around the same age group and maybe you're just like, oh wow, I'm running out of time. They're here, I should be there. Why am I not there? Am I ever gonna make it? Am I gonna be broke forever? Am I gonna stay in my parents' house forever? Am I gonna have like 90 cats when I grow up? Am I ever gonna get married? Is anybody ever? Let me calm down. Yeah, I'm just gonna get so anxious about this. This one's a sensitive one. If one thing's gonna hold you back more than anything in this world, it's comparing yourself to other people feeling as though other people don't deserve their success and allowing it to make you bitter. So now that we've discussed where jealousy stems from and the different things that you can be jealous of other people for, let's talk about how the hell you get over it. Now, 
I'm gonna share these with you because they worked so well for me and I really hope that they work for you as well. The first thing that you should do in order to overcome jealousy is write down five things that you're grateful for. They can be big or they can be small, doesn't matter. Then write down five things that you are great at. They can be serious or they can be silly, doesn't matter. Five things that you're great at, write them down. And then write down five things that you've accomplished and you're proud of yourself for. They can be big or they can be small, like a little baby dick. <laughs> write them down at a place that you will constantly see so that they can become embedded, engraved into your mind. And then whenever you start to feel these insecure feelings or this, these feelings of jealousy, just say them over and over and over again in your mind. And I'll tell you why this works so well. It's because we are what we think. The conversation that you have in your mind is the most important conversation that you will have throughout your entire life. And if you're constantly bringing yourself down, just constantly thinking, I don't know if I'm good enough, or what if I never make it, or what if my dreams are really impossible and I'm crazy. If you're constantly saying things like that in your mind, you're programming your brain to think that way. Please never forget that. Another way to overcome your jealousy is to start a new project, a project that's gonna keep you positive and happy and encouraged, a project that's gonna keep you so busy and so focused on what you are doing that you don't have time to worry about what other people are doing. Ain't nobody got time for that. Because you're working on yourself. You are working diligently on yourself and your future. Invest your money and your time and your energy into a new project. My new project is YouTube. Also, another way to overcome your jealousy is to start taking better care of your body and your health. The things that we put into our body affect our brains, the chemicals in our brains. They affect so much more than the fat on our body. And outside of dieting and exercising, brush your teeth twice a day, wash your face, Clean your room, organize your space. If your space is cluttered, you're gonna, you're gonna be a mess. Your mind's gonna be all over the place. You wanna conquer jealousy? Start to feel better about yourself and what you bring to the table. And please, before I end this video, please do not forget that comparison is suicide. You will kill yourself mentally and emotionally if you continue to compare yourself to other people. Your only competition should be the person that you see in the mirror. That's it. Compete to be better than you were yesterday, every single day. I hope you guys liked this video. I really hope that it helps. Go out into the world, try this, feel great about yourself. You are unstoppable. The only thing holding you back is yourself.